Welcome to Shopping with Peg and Robin. And I'm here with a new box. Ooh. <coughs> However, before I show you the new box, I want to show you my outfit. Yeah. Now, I know you probably wouldn't normally put this together. I think uh, it looks fun. I bought the two pieces from the same place. And when she delivered it, I had to put it, when I picked it up from her, I should say, I had to put it on to see, you know, just to try both pieces. And I actually liked how it went together. So I'm going to be sharing a link to her store down below. It's uh -huh. Sean Berry. She's here in Delaware at this time. This is actually long sleeves. I actually got the last of these mm -hmm. tops. I like how when you do that, the bottom sort of flips up where it's got the twirly, the twirly ruffle. But I love this shirt. I love me some some leopard print. Yay. So just had to show you that. I put a set of my mom's old beads with it to mm -hmm. give it some color. Nice. So anyway. We are here with a new box. Ooh, that you haven't even peeked in I yet. have not even looked at it. My husband has cut the thing open. Mm hmm This is from Mix and Batch. Okay. I sent back my, my stuff that I didn't get, and I forgot to tell them, please don't send anything right away. Mm-hmm. The next thing I knew, it was like, guess what? You got a box shipped your way. It's like, no, wait, wait. So... I have no money. I'm either going to have to beg with them to let me extend the date or send everything back. Mm. But I might as well look. Mm -hmm. um, I don't even know who the stylist is for this. If it's still Liz or what. Let me see here. Okay. doesn't tell me who my stylist is on this. I'm scared to find out what the prices are. <laughs> Isis is watching up in the bookshelf, you see? I do. But what do you have in that box? They actually sent me jeans. Too. I said I was willing to consider jeans. Mm-hmm. Okay. Hi, Peggy. In this style box, you have the cardigan you asked for. You had asked for moto style, which I thought I had, but didn't. I improvised with a pair of olive jeans in somewhat of a similar color. Hope you love them. Also, I just had to send the Liverpool leggings in this beautiful color, even though they are on the expensive side. Um, oh, boy. With 25% off, they wind up to be around $65. Dang. Well, I have a feeling I'll be sending those back. <sighs> I, um, I hope this style box works as well as the first one in both fit and style. I did get Liz again. Yay! Okay. That's, that's so. dangerous because you're more likely to like everything in it, right? She and I corresponded back and forth quite a bit. <laughs> so I'm going to have to write her back. Oh, Liz! I like how they wrap that. Isn't that pretty? I also like the color of the bow. Hi, I know. Hi, that hi. is so pretty. Okay, thank you for letting us style you mix and match. If you want to toss the box this way, you can set the burritos on the table. So I guess I'll open the top one. Mm-hmm. Turn this just a little bit. So we know there's blue. Mm-hmm. It's coming through almost black on the screen. It's a very dark blue. And there's gray. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm not sure how I feel about that. And oh Lord. What is it? If those are the if those are the leggings, I'm in trouble because <laughs> they're like a maroon color. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's pull it out and see what we have. Oh, this is by Gilly. Oh, I like this. I love this. Is that a jacket? It is. Okay, it's like a kimono, a bat wing, or um, I forget what you call them. Mm hmm. I'll go ahead and try it on now. It looks, it's got that slightly slouch comfy look. Oh, I like how it's short in the back. I don't know how I feel about being short in the back. Liz really gets me. <laughs> I've got to say, Liz really gets me. Okay, I'm going to leave it on for a minute, even though it's hot today. <laughs> See what the damage is. This navy open front cardigan with three quarter sleeves is forty two dollars. Mm. Now, can you rock those up higher <coughs> if you want to? Because I.
because I know you like to tuck your sleeves up higher. It looks like it's a bit grippy around the... Uh... It is a bit grippy. I still can do it. It's because mm -hmm. I have these underneath. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can definitely do that. I mean, the grippy helps because it won't keep falling back down your arms. Yes. That is Ooh. cute. Look at the ties on the sleeves. Ooh. <laughs> Gilly gray v-neck blouse with three-quarter tie sleeve and charcoal hem, $38. And what are the fabrics like? Um, Is it soft? It's soft. I'm finding I really love Gilly. Mm -hmm. The price on this is normally $62. Oh. So it's on sale. What's the charcoal head trim like? Um, it's kind of like... Oh, it looks a little bit sheer. I can see you through yes. it a little. It is... Mm, this, the, the contrast is 100% polyester, this okay. part. And then it's 87% polyester, 10% rayon, and 3% spandex. Ooh. You want me to stop the video so you can put it on? No, I'm going to put them on all, all on later and cry. <laughs> Get the eye wants over everything. Oh, that's interesting how they use the uh, the level of detail for that contrast there. I don't know how I feel about it, but it is interesting. This is by Cory... Cory America. Okay. It's $38. Mm-hmm. I have mixed feelings. Ooh, are those, there's like a strip, straps, do those hang in front or back? Those hang in front. Okay. Ah, there we go. Tassels. That I'm like, mm -hmm. Yeah. Liverpool Reese leggings in Meritage. I already like the seams on them. I had to go in and ask what the pool is like, didn't I? Oh my goodness. And they've got this, uh, almost like a waist control thing maybe in there. Mm -hmm. Can you bring it a little closer to the camera? Here we go. Oh, I see. That's some pretty decent heavy-duty spandex type stuff. Very nice. I bet it would be very smoothing up there. So that's the first part. Okay. Oops. Why did they have to send this when I have no, the payday when I have no money for <laughs> oh. I'm betting you this is the cardigan I told her I wanted to try. <laughs> tall compared to some of the, uh, oh, that's because the, cause it's a cardigan, not just a regular jacket, but. Oh, I like that. Okay, so. It looks heavy and warm. It's very heavy. Can you let the cat out? <coughs> sure. Come here, cat. Jojo, you going out? Jojo. Come on, go out. Come on, Jojo. Go on. Thank you. I think he's afraid of the leopard that just entered the room. <laughs> That is not bad. How much is it? $62. Okay. That is not bad at all. And Kayla, if you're watching, I bet you'd love this too. <laughs> oh. Want to take off the jacket and try it? I forgot I had on this jacket. <laughs> it's comf that comfortable. It's so huh? comfortable. the silver in your hair. I'm not sure if I'm just imagining that or... Now, I think for me, that sort of length would feel uncomfortable. I'd always be like, oh, I'm sitting on it or whatever, but 
I think you've had one uh, stuffed at least before, and you liked oh, yeah. it? Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Arms are a little bit long, but that's easy. That's just, you know. Mm. Okay, I'm going to leave this on for a little bit. <laughs> okay. Uh, just, just a quick question. Can you push the sleeves up to your elbows and have them stay? Wait a minute, I've got another thing up here. Uh -huh. Okay, cool. Just curious, because I know you're probably going to end up doing that a lot. You know me too well. Yes. Okay, this is Gilly. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. V-neck, um, no, Gilly, Gilly. Navy, black, white. Gilly V-neck, black, white, geo blouse. Ooh, it's like squares instead of polka dots. That's cute. I like that. Could you come in like a, a couple steps closer so that they can see more of the detail? That is cute. Okay, thank you. Okay, now finally. What's the fabric like? Is it soft? It is, um, it's, it's soft. It's a dressy soft. It's not like t-shirt soft. Mm. Gotcha, gotcha. But it's still very comfortable. It's and it, it ties on the sleeves. And it has the... Uh, Ooh, nice lining. Yeah. 95% polyester, 5% spandex, 100% polyester on the uh, lining. That is cute. I really... And the lining is in the front. Okay. Oh, I can tell you already, I don't like these. You don't like those jeans? Yeah. But, you'll see why. So this is, first of all, Ellen B. Olive Cuff Jeans with Lace Insets. Mm-hmm. Is that the little bits of red I see at the top? They're $42. Oh, the laces and the knees. That's kind of cute. It's, it's... Too much distressed for your taste? <coughs> yes, it is. Mm. I will try them on. Mm -hmm. Now, I like the little bit of red trim around the inside of the, uh, the waistline. I know no one's going <coughs> to see that, but it's still cute. are real pockets. Yay! And they look nice and big. That's how you could get your hands in there pretty well. Yay! I'm going to let you show the trim a little over the lace. Da, da, da. Oh, I like that green lace. Let's see if it'll focus. Oh, that is nice. You're going to be wishing this was in your size. <laughs> okay. And then just the regular... Somewhat distressed look. That is really pretty. <coughs> that is probably the only piece in the box where I'm going, uh-uh. <laughs> okay, catch. Oh. Definitely. Uh. So anyway, we will take a break for a bit. I will try on some pieces. Okay. I may get something for my throat first. Yes, and it's hot out. We could use a break anyway. Yes, yeah, so it, we may finish this in a little while. But um, that's my box. It was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces. Ooh. If I kept all seven, mm -hmm. it'd be $347. That's a lot. Before the 25% discount of $86.75. Uh-huh. Which would bring it to $260.25. Still a lot. Still a lot. But there were a lot of thick clothes in there, big clothes, really high quality fabrics. I can see where the cost is coming from. That just doesn't change the fact that it is expensive. Yeah. I can tell you I do see five pieces I would like to keep. Mm-hmm. Possibly six. <laughs> Everything but the, the jeans, right? Everything but the jeans. But, um... Oh, this is going to be tough. 
So the big question will be, can I work with them and say, um, you know, with this government shutdown, um, can you wait two weeks <laughs> to my next paycheck? <laughs> so anyway, that's the box. We'll come back in a bit and we'll do, uh, we'll show you the different pieces individually. Yay. Thanks for watching. Bye. Welcome back to Shopping with Peg. And Robin. And of course, we are now on the showing the clothing part of the, uh, of the video. Of the video. Now you've got to know I must kind of like this shirt because I'm trying it on with a skirt that didn't come in the box because <laughs> I wanted to see how it would look. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is a $38 top from Gilly. Mm -hmm. I really love the pattern. When I first tried it on um, when we did the box, when we first opened the box almost a week ago, I was like, oh, I don't know. And I wasn't sure about it. But trying it on today, I really do like it. I know it probably doesn't hang quite right mm -hmm. i don't know but i think it's something i would go for several times in my closet so i'm trying to make a decision here i do like the fact it has the white mm -hmm. lining i really like that the only part that makes me nervous is this part right there why i just i'm not sure if it's supposed to be white or black or you know so it's is not it like both sides showing is what's you know so it's not like it's plunging too low or it's an issue with the lining no. it's 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 an issue with, should the white money be showing? Is it showing on both sides? Is it equally showing on both sides? Gotcha. You know, so, but I love the, what it does to the arms. Mm hmm I just really like it. My husband's not a fan of it. What do you think of it now that you're seeing it? I mean, I just skirt. It's pretty. Um, it's not jumping out at me as super awesome, but it's, it's cool. So... Anyway, I'm going to try it on with the jeggings, or with the leggings next, so we'll see how it looks with leggings. Okay. It yeah. is here <laughs> to help me show you the leggings from Liverpool. So now, I'm going to go ahead and put Regina down. Can you pull the, the shirt up a little bit so we can see the color better? Yes. It's still coming out mostly black. Make sure my settings on my screen. It's, the color is... What they call it is M E R I T A G E. Meritage? Mirage. I call it more of a, a cranberry or plum, or uh -huh. it's in that color family. Okay. Now, I, I told her I'd be willing to consider Liverpool uh -huh. because three of my favorite shows. Watch out for Kitten on your, when you sit down. On YouTube. Three of my favorite shows love Liverpool. Mm -hmm. uh, Kayla's Closet loves Li Liverpool jeans. Georgia Sunshine loves Liverpool jeans. And Sisters and Stitches love Liverpool. Okay. So I thought, well, I'll go ahead and try them. These are a little long for me. You can't really see it, but they're bunched up a bit around my ankles. Mm -hmm. And, okay, here are my thoughts on Liverpool. They're very soft. Mm-hmm. They're comfortable. Mm -hmm. I like the um, waistline, the waist control thing. Mm -hmm. But they're eighty nine dollars. Mm. Even at twenty five percent off, they'd bring them at like sixty something. Mm -hmm. And honestly, you don't like them that much. I can get four pairs of jeggings from Walmart that actually fit me better. Mm -hmm. Um, at Walmart. So I think that these are definitely going back. I do understand why people love Liverpool. But these don't fit you right? These just don't. The, the, they're, I'd have to roll them up at the bottom. And since they're dress pants and they have the ridge down the front, that just wouldn't really look like right to me. Okay. Um, they do come up. I do like the back. Uh-huh. Um, I like the front. Comes up nicely. I like it when it comes to my belly button. Mm -hmm. So I do like that about it, but no, just, they're really out of my price range, and I think I really would, if I had them, if I kept them. They'd never be your first choice, would they? No, they would be my last choice when everything else is in the laundry. Okay. Partly because of all the cats we have around here that I could picture clawing them, because mm. they don't work outside the home, but partly just because... They're just not my first choice. Okay. Well, that's good to know. So, 
With that, we're going. I am going to try them on with the next top, though. Okay. Okay. Go with the next top. Yay. It's by Cory K O R I America. Uh -huh. It's thirty eight dollars. Mm -hmm. Now I can't understand why she's sending. I think it goes really well with these uh, leggings mm -hmm. from Liverpool. I think it complements the color. Maybe this. Does this show the color of the leggings any better? Not on my screen, really. Okay. Maybe go better on the t on the uh, computer monitor. The leggings are almost this color. <laughs> So anyway, it's it's cute. It's not me. It's it's it would be a hippie version of me or something. It's just yeah, it's not me. Okay. Um, what do you think of it? Um, I like the um, the I like the contrasting fabrics. The, I don't know that I like those fabrics. I I like having lots of of different fabrics together on the same piece. Um, but. I don't think that flaring out right under the breast is necessarily the best look for you. Yeah. Um, I don't think that those particular patterns, um, um, uh, fabrics are necessarily the best for you. Um, if it was a different cut, but it still had, you know, oh, here's a, here's the, the front piece, and then here's the side pieces, right. and here's the trim around the bottom. You know, maybe, but... I really love the. I do like this fabric. Mm-hmm. And I love this bottom fabric. Mm -hmm. And I think she'd probably pick this up because I told her I liked mixed media. Mm -hmm. um, but I feel like I should be like six months pregnant if I'm wearing this. Mm. Which I admit, I look like I'm pregnant. But um, no, it's just, it's it's cute. I love the colors. But no, it's just not me. Yeah, it would look great on someone else. Oh, it would. And for $38, it's a good price. Mm. So, okay, next top and bottom. Okay, and boop. With the final top, mm -hmm. the jeans did not fit. Mm -hmm. I'll show them in a minute. They were 22. I probably would have needed a 24. Mm -hmm. But anyway, let's look at this top. Kind of a light sweatshirty material. Mm -hmm. But I think it has a cute sort of casual look to it and might have been nice with the jeans if the jeans had fit. Right. I love, I gotta admit, I love this at the bottom. Mm -hmm. It's not really showing up well against the black skirt. Sorry. That's okay. But, this, it just sits very tight on me, uh -huh. where the bottom is, and it's, I just don't feel like it would look that good. Okay. And fit that good. Okay. So, this was a good price. This was like $38 also, if my memory serves me correctly. Uh -huh. um, I'll take a quick here at the box but, um, it just... I'm not sure it really does anything for you that other stuff doesn't already do better. Yeah. That's pretty much where we're at. So, here's where we're at. This is a definite new. Mm-hmm. Okay. The jeans, which Robin tried on, mm -hmm. are a definite no. Mm-hmm. Too big for her, too small for me. Yes. I was really afraid putting them on there. I was going to put my feet through the lace. Mm-hmm. Um, I didn't have so much a problem with the lace, but I did almost put my foot through the distressed part on the other leg. Yeah. I just... They're just not me. Mm. Okay. So, I'm going to toss this Robin's way. Okay. Okay. Oh, for me, but I just said I don't like them. I know. So, that leaves us now with the leggings. Mm-hmm. Which, um... Very, very nice. Very, very expensive. And just not really your first choice ever. No. I don't think they'd ever be my first choice to pick in the closet. Mm. So, there we know. Don't you just let me throw your stuff at the camera? <laughs> Makes you feel like it's going to land right beside you wherever you're watching this. <laughs> okay, that brings us to this cute little top. Mm -hmm. Which would be absolutely cute on maybe Meg Ryan. Mm -hmm. Uh... Something like that. Um, it just doesn't really feel all that flattering for your body shape. It's like it's trying to hide the fact that you have a belly as opposed to just, you know, being a nice shirt. Yeah. Yeah. It's really, um, I mean, it has a boho look that I can imagine like Meg Ryan or someone wearing. And I kind of like stuff like that, but it's just, no, it's, it's not me. Mm. But I do love the colors. Okay. So, there goes that. Whoop. So, that leaves me with the dilemma. What to buy. What to definitely keep. Mm -hmm. I really like this black top. Mm -hmm. 
from one to ten, mm -hmm. it's about an eight and a half. Oh. The question is, how often would I pull it out of my closet to wear it? Would it go okay with like jeans, or would I need a uh, a skirt with it? Mm hmm. Now you know how much I love pattern mixing. I would love to see that with your black and white striped jeans. Black and white stripes. Well, it's got like faint gray pinstripes. Oh, okay. Um, so I really, I, this is almost a yes. The problem is it's $38. Mm -hmm. Um, well, the problem is finances right now. I've already told them that if I can't postpone my first payment till February 1st, I'm have to send it all back. Mm -hmm. So she's getting back to me on that. Okay. $38. What, about, what about if you can postpone it? Do you think if I can postpone it, I'm seriously considering getting that, mm -hmm. getting this blue. The only thing is I need to go through my closet to see what else I have in this style. Um, I don't know that you have much in that soft slouchy cut that's I, not a, uh, a thicker fabric. I, I know I have a long, a, a long duster length one that's about this color, mm -hmm. and I know I have a uh, denim jean, um, not striped, ribbed mm. one, uh, one of their Lindsay's, and I think that's all I've got. If that's all I've got, if I haven't, if I don't find something else, at forty two dollars, this is a good price. Okay. Um, so I probably would get that too. Okay. And I went and I wore this the other day to Cato. Uh huh. And I showed my girlfriend there. Uh huh. And she was like, she started looking at it and she was looking all over. She goes, that's really nice stitching. That's really good quality. And you know, she was, she really imp was impressed with it. And I told her how much it was and she was like, because she runs Cato, she knows their prices. She was like, that's a bit high. This is really a signature piece. Mm -hmm. And she goes, and it looks so good on you. <laughs> and you told me you only have one heavy piece like this, other than this. Mm -hmm. And it's in black and red, so it's not the same color family. So she actually recommended getting it. Nice. And how much is that again? It is $62. Okay. I told her, I said, I wish that it was made by Cato, because then it'd be 30 something. <laughs> <laughs> Um, if I can get them to delay it till February 1st, my first payment, I am definitely getting this. Mm. I am probably getting the blue top and the, uh, polka dot top. Mm -hmm. But the one big question is if I had to choose between um, the blue top or the black polka dot. Which of the two would you get? Which of the two would I get? Mm. That's the toughie. Mm. So, down below, I'm going to ask my uh, watchers, let me know down below, what do you think? Should I get those t two tops? Should I get only one of them, or should I get none of them? Mm -hmm. This one, don't bother telling me not to get. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this one, as long as they'll let me pay on the first, it's mine. Okay. So, um, so that's the big question, though, is should I get, I know the blue top will go with a lot. I can probably use it three months out of the year. Mm-hmm. The black top will also go with, well, it's not maybe not quite as wide a range, but it's it's really kind of fun, you know. Mm -hmm. The problem is I've got like five or six black tops, but none of them are polka dot. <laughs> um, and I really like the sleeves. I really like the that open sleeve concept. Um, I think it's youthful and stuff. Okay. So anyway, I guess that's going to be it. Uh, reader or watchers, please let us know below. What do you think? Should we keep one top, both tops? Which one? Um, and anyone want a kitten? No. <laughs> <laughs> We've got cats wandering around here. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Um, and thanks for shopping with Peg and Robin. Yes, yeah, so and don't forget to hit the subscribe button below because we're about to be making some changes and uh, you'll be wanting to know about those. So thank you so much. You have a great day. See you later. Bye. Bye-bye.